I appreciate everyone. You know, uh, it's been a while since I did a live, and it's been a while since I did a video. So I thought I would come on the channel and go live today. The weather's been terrible. I'm in Ohio. The weather's terrible. Those of you up north, you know what I'm talking about. I've been busy with some stuff. And um, I've made a lot of decisions in my life and thought about a lot of things. You know, I'm not finished. Uh, not finished in my life at all. I'm not really ready to lay down on the beach and retire. <clears throat> I'm investing in some properties and I'm investing in some things. And of course, my credit's a lot better now than it was. It's getting better every day. But I want to be in warm weather. So what is happening is I'm making plans to do that. I've been doing some paperwork and signing some things, you know, you got to take out a loan and you got to sign this and sign that. So I am investigating right now in buy, I'm buying a little resort. It's not too far from the United States Mexican border. It's really nice there. The temperature's awesome. Um, it, it's just going to be warm all year round. And nothing else. I'm going to really enjoy it. Really love that. Um, It's a property that's inside two walls that run like this. It's got a property at one at each end. And in the middle, it has a nice swimming pool. And the swimming pool is uh it's pretty it's pretty decent. It's pretty nice. Um it's not square, it's kind of goes around like that, kind of, I don't know. But it has a outside hot tub. And uh, swimming pool has a little shelter there, and some palm trees. You know, it's really nice, and it's private. From the uh, one side has a house that I'm going to be renting, and I'm going to be living in the other side if everything goes through. So that's what I'm working on. Um, the rental side is a property. It's it's awesome. It's a very expensive piece of property. It is, uh, it's got an overlook porch, nice porch with a roof, two story up on the second floor that overlooks the swimming pool. Big, great party area, great vacation area. Someone could live there even. It's got a, it's got a, a two car garage. The house that I'm going to be living in is a three bedroom. The other house is two bedroom. Very nice. Um, you actually walk out your back door, which is really, everything is very nice. And you walk right into the pool. Now, like I said, the pool is private. The hot tub is private. So technically, technically someone could go skinny dip in there and uh, no one could see or watch. You know, it's got cement walls around it, like I said. And um, I don't know uh, exactly how far it is from the U.S.-Mexican border, but it's not really far, maybe maybe 15 minutes drive or something like that. Um, it's warm. And I'm going down this uh, month to again, and I'm going to be doing some videos on that. So that's the update. And I, um, on April the 8th, I'm gonna to try to catch, the eclipse is coming over Ohio. I'm gonna to try to catch some videos on the eclipse and um, I want to put that on this channel, so I want you to check it out. Expect that on April the 8th. I might try to do a live, a live eclipse shot. There's only a few minutes where it's going to be the best view, and then after that it kind of, you know, goes out. I think there's three or four hours there that it can be seen. I don't know how to buy these. These are recommended, however dumb they look. They say the eclipse can damage your eyes so don't look at them with your naked eye <coughs> wow 
So that's my goals. Um, I got a lot of things in the making. Um, I'll be right across the border from Mexico. Eventually on this channel, I may do some Mexico trips. And um, there's a lot going on. You know, I haven't been on this channel because I got things going on. Um, it's It's been Harley weather a few times. Haven't really had the chance to get the Harleys out like I wanted to. And um, if I make this move, I, I got to... Uh, I got to transfer from one place to another place. Got to sell a house and I'm reinvesting that money and it's already it's all set up and um it, which is not even close to being enough with what I saved it's not enough of course. But uh this resort I thing is either way I'm going to live there and love it, you know. It's got a couple palm trees, um like I said a, a outside hot tub Swimming pool, a little shelter there. It's private. It's inside the walls. The properties are immaculate. I mean, these are properties that just... I'm just going to do the investment and um, live there. And these are properties that... Uh, oh, it's way better than living in a hotel or anything. I um, had thought about some prices, and I... You can't rent a hotel, I don't think, as nice as this property anywhere. And um, I'm thinking for vacation-wise, anybody that wants to have a vacation there, it's all private, like I said, and um, it's got security bars and security gates and things like that. Um, I'm thinking like 300 a day and uh, maybe, maybe 1,500 a week, or even I might go down to 3,000 or 3,500 a month. And um, that's access to the pool, 24/7. You know, have to you'll have to sign an agreement to the, you know, not to drown yourself. And if you do, it's your fault. And uh, you know, I got to get insurance on everything first and get everything set up. This is going to take six or eight weeks, probably more. And um, <clears throat> I'm going to be driving back and forth from this location to Ohio to get everything worked out and it's not going to be easy and I got to move all my crap down there I'm going to try to eliminate most of my crap and not move too much and um, I'm going to definitely be living on one side of that pool and uh, you know oversee the property there's some other properties there that I'm interested in on the border because I want tropical I, I just want you know, and I don't want to have to fly overseas every 15 minutes to get tropical. This is tropical. Where I'm at, <clears throat> I mean, palm trees are growing and everything. It's tropical. It's nice. And, uh, you know, I got a nice uh, cement dog kennel there. I can have my, have a dog or whatever I want. And um, it's just a wonderful site, a wonderful place to live. And I will be renting this out. You know, I will take deposits um, once I get everything settled and get it actually get the property in my name. I will be taking deposits and renting this this out for vacation. Like I said, if someone wanted to live there, I'd probably work something out. Three thousand thirty-five hundred. All utilities paid. You, the air conditioning electric is going to be really high because it gets hot there. I guess. Uh, I guess in the summertime, I'm looking at 110 degrees. In the wintertime, it goes all the way down to 70 degrees Fahrenheit, from what I hear. 70 in the wintertime. But, you know, with the pool right there, part of the house, and I want to I make sure everything works really good on the pool constantly. Um, you know, it's, it's not going to be cheap to, for me to upkeep it. Um, but I just want to kind of announce it, and once I get the property, you will see it. I will show it to you. And um, look forward to seeing the clips. I hope, I hope I can get a good shot. You know, something maybe something live on the eclipse, April the eighth. And uh, my cameras are going off in my house. Uh, the wind is blowing things around. That's that. That's that noise you hear. Um, it's real windy today. They had tornado warnings yesterday. Tornado watch and all that crap. 
and I guess the tornado touched down in northern Ohio somewhere, west, uh, midwestern Ohio, um, a couple weeks ago. So there's some tragedies been going on, and uh, you know they're declaring an emergency on April the 8th here for that uh, that um, uh, eclipse. Can you believe that? They're, they're declaring an emergency around Ohio. Ohio's going to be an emergency state. Can you, I guess the last eclipse in Ohio was in 1806. So, if you just joined, they say this is better than any sunglasses. And uh, isn't that crazy? I can't see anything. You absolutely cannot see through those at all. Nothing. It's just all, you know, I guess that... I guess when the moon gets in front of the sun and the, the light goes around the moon, it magnifies the sunlight somehow. And uh, they say it can damage a naked eye quickly. So I just wanted to update everyone. And um, Cebu, boss man, yo, he said, yo, yo. So, um, See how things go, but I will be doing some videos from the little resort, and um, I'm just going to chill, man. I'm going to be chilling like McMillan and loving life. I want to drag the Harleys down there in a trailer, and uh, maybe I, you know, would be shooting videos from the from the border. I think Texas pretty much has that all wrapped up, you know, chained up. Everything's pretty secure. Biden's not doing anything to secure it. He's, letting everyone in, but uh, Texas, the governor and everybody is uh, working on that. So, and I'm not really concerned either way, but you know, I, where I'm at, I will have security and I got cameras and you know, et cetera, et cetera. So alarm system and everything to set up. And uh, I want to put out some, uh, eventually put out some solar lights have lights around the pool 24-7. And um, hit hit the thumbs up if you don't mind. And um, don't give up on me. Don't give up on the channel, you know. I just got some stuff. I've been busy. I'm just doing some things, you know. And just wanted to give you an update on everything. And I appreciate all of you. And uh, I've been seeing miracles. I've been praying. God is moving. I've been seeing miracles. God is real, you know. Uh, I've been doing working with the ministry, and uh, just amazing stuff going on, really. It's my camera going off again on my front porch. I can pick it, hold up my phone and see all the cameras in the house, front and back porches and the side and everything. So, and even when I was in the Philippines, I could watch the cameras and watch my house. It's pretty cool, and I have... Uh, I have direct calling to the United States from any country for 25 cents a minute. So actually I could got, you know, get on the phone and call the police if I had to and be in another country, which is cool. But that's my plans. That's what I'm planning to do. Um, I'm planning to have that uh, little resort. There'll be one nice house. It's not a little room. It's not, it's a two bedroom house. You know, it's got a little pet wash tub and uh your stove, refrigerator, washers, dryer, everything, man. It's got it's hooked up. It's nice. And uh I'm thinking three hundred a day for vacation, fifteen hundred a week. You know, if you want it for a month, maybe thirty five hundred a month. And I'll pay utilities out of that. Utilities will probably be at least five hundred, maybe I don't know what the air conditioner to run, being as hot as it is there. But uh, if you get a chance, go back and see this video again. And hey, I'll I'll be back April the eighth. Um, I'm not sure. I think it's in the afternoon. I forgot. Um, you can look it up online, but I'll be back April the 8th. I'll get up early, try to hit that, uh, everything about the eclipse. Maybe I can station a camera somewhere and just run it live. That's what I'm thinking. Depends on, I could probably put one in my yard somewhere on the rooftop of the truck or something. I don't know. And just keep it on the eclipse. And run a live uh, video feed on April the eighth. That's that's my hope. I don't know if I can see through the. You know, I, right now I can't see through these things. It's just I'm not gonna be able to see anything actually. 
it's just like I guess looking right at the eclipse. Um, and if I can't, even, wouldn't won't even be able to run a camera and let with these over my eyes. I don't know how that's going to work. But uh, I just want to update everyone and um, keep in touch with you, let you know my plans. I'm going to be doing some traveling around the border in, in Texas, all the way to Texas from Ohio, either this month or next month again, even two or three times a month now. And uh, I appreciate you, you know, hang in there. And that's my plans. That's what I'm doing. And I just want to let you know. May God bless you forever and always. Subscribe.